This is Credit Matters and I'm Greg Moskowitz of the Global Fixed Income Research Group. The U.S. distress ratio continues its upward climb and now stands at 15.7% as of September 15th, a level last surpassed in 2011. The oil and gas sector accounted for 95 of the 270 issues in the distress ratio. The sector at 40% of total distressed debt and the second highest sector distress ratio at 41.9%. The U.S. distress ratio has been at an elevated level since December. The metal mining and steel sector had the highest sector distress ratio at 53.4% and the second most issues at 47. Distressed credits are speculative grade issues with option adjusted composite spreads of more than 1,000 basis points relative to U.S. Treasuries. The ratio indicates the level of risk the market has priced into the bonds. A rising distress ratio reflects an increased need for capital and typically is a precursor to more defaults when accompanied by a severe sustained market disruption. The default rate, a lagging indicator of distress, increased to 2.21% as of July 31st from 2.01% as of June 30th. This has been Credit Matters. Thank you for watching.